Synthesis of an mRNA begins in the nucleus. There, transcription factors and coactivators bind to enhancer sequences. These factors are joined by general transcription factors, SRBs, and RNA polymerase II at the promoter to assemble a transcription initiation complex. When transcription begins, the carboxyl terminal domain of Pol2 becomes heavily phosphorylated. The 5' prime end of the growing RNA is protected from 5' prime exonucleases by a cap of 7 methyl G. A cap binding complex and different kinds of HNRNPs bind to the RNA. The spliceosome, made up of SNRNAs and proteins, removes introns from the RNA. At a polyadenylation signal, a protein complex cleaves the mRNA and adds a poly-A tail on the 3' prime end. A poly-A binding protein and a cap binding complex protect the mRNA and aid the RNA's export into the cytoplasm. There, an initiation factor binds the cap, while other proteins bind the mRNA and poly-A tail. The message is now prepared for translation. Initiation factors, the 40S ribosomal subunit, and the initiator tRNA scan for the nearest AUG start codon. Translation begins when the 60S subunit binds to form the ribosome and ends when the ribosome encounters a stop codon. As translation continues, the poly-A tail shortens. Below a critical length, the mRNA loses its 5' prime cap and is degraded.